The government says it wanted to see the old police barracks refurbished and restored at no cost to the taxpayer in order to remove an eyesore from the landscape. According to the government, given the complexity of the site and the additional cost of construction in such a confined area, the site was awarded to the only interested party in the sum of £175,000. GBC understands this site had long been an unattractive proposition for developers, with several tender processes over the years failing to lead to development. It was sold in a state of disrepair in 2013, full of squatters, rats and lots of rubbish. 200 tonnes of rubbish, in fact, as it had become a dumping ground. And due to its location in the upper town, the developers had to remove the rubbish in two and a half ton trucks. The real cost of the plot of land, therefore, would be the price paid by the developers to the government of Gibraltar, as well as the cost of the soft strip, removing the existing doors and windows, the significant rubbish removal, the demolition and the structural repairs. During the Viewpoint documentary, Simcoe Partners explained the extensive specialist work that was required to restore the building's iconic arches. They said renovating old buildings, especially those with significant heritage value, was much more expensive than constructing a building from scratch.